please welcome the lovely Jessica Alba. <laughs> Congratulations on Fantastic Four. That was a big hit, wasn't it? Yes, yeah. thank you. It, um, it, it broke the box office slump. Oh, well, that's so very we're good. Very, very excited. Good. Yeah, thank you, everyone who saw Fantastic yeah. Four. Now, I read something about you. I read that you, as a kid, you had OCD. What is that, the compulsive? No, uh, I did. I, uh, when I was a kid, for some reason, um, I washed my hands yeah. constantly. I was never the kid with filthy hands. And right. I would, like, lock the doors and unplug everything in the house every night. I, I just, a weird thing. I, but I heard you had a little OCD thing. Me? I heard you, don't you do something before you come out here? I don't pay attention. What'd you say? <laughs> no, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I, yeah, probably. I don't notice it. I probably like touch the wall or do something. You, you know what you do? What that, do I do? That, what do I do? You wear a lot of denim shirts. No, all I have is denim shirts. I have, every year I buy 20 pair of denim pants. So that's a little I, OCD. And I buy 40, no, so I never have to shop because I just wear the same thing, you know. I mean. And it goes with your eyes. And it goes with my, exactly. I do it because it goes with my eyes. That's the important part. So when did you get over it? Do you still do it? Are you still? Well, I'm not like, you know. <laughs> no, I, really? I, <laughs> no, I mean, my, uh, yeah, I, I have, I make, I make cash wash his hands a lot, too. Really? Yeah, huh? yeah it's a problem. I don't know. Now, I saw your movie, and I enjoyed it very much. Now, and you're in, you're in the water a lot in this movie. Are you a good swimmer? Is that something? I am, yeah. yeah. I, um, I started swimming before I knew how to walk, actually. My mother was a lifeguard. Oh, okay. But, um... What's funny is I was on a swim, a swim team when I was nine, and okay. I was going through that awkward stage, and I was almost as tall as I am now. I was like 5'2", right. 9, and I was overweight, and my parents thought it would be a great idea for me to be part of a swim team. Oh. And, and, you know, my brother and I have dark skin, right. and everyone else was little and skinny and white, and then two giant... Mexican-looking kids <laughs> in the water. Well, Mind you, we were the only ones that were mixed yeah. with anything. It was like a very Caucasian environment. <laughs> and, uh, and I would bring, you know, 30 relatives, and everyone would bring their mom or their dad. Right. And, uh, yeah, and well, so I'm, and I'm like the biggest one, so I'm in last place. Like every meet, no joke, I'm suffering. I'm running into the, like, the, the little wire yeah. in the middle and the side, and I'm going slow and dying and crying. And my dad's like, you got to finish everything you start. So I would hold up all the meats and, and, be, and be the slowest But your family there. would cheer you on. My family was see, always there to cheer me on. See, that's the great thing about we the Latin family. rolling 30 deep. Yeah, like, the... you know, I'm Ital my Italian relatives, like when I got started in show business, I'd play a club, and other friends like their dad or their mom would come. My grandmother, my uncle, hey, Jay on the stage, come on, buddy, hey! And they'd be in the exactly. audience screaming at Jay, hey, pretty funny Jay! You know, I go, Uncle Lou, yeah. calm down. Please. And <laughs> especially when you're bombing. You oh, yeah. You need to, like, draw attention. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I was always, like, the slowest. But then picture day comes, and my mom did, did full, like, glamour shots, like hair, makeup, big hair, yeah. lots of makeup. I'm nine, and I'm huge. And, <laughs> and you know, and everyone else is, like, little and, and I would cute. kill to get that picture. No, Can you bring me that? I know. No, I, I, I will ten thousand dollars to anyone who has that. Picture. <laughs> yeah. It's, now it's in this true. movie, you spend a lot of time in the in your, in your bikini. Yeah, I do. Now, how was your grandma about this? I know your grandmother's pretty strict. Isn't she pretty strict? Yeah, my grandmother yeah. would never let us wear a bathing suit indoors or right. really around her unless we were at the pool right. at the country club. Yeah. So yeah, whenever um, I was in the house in a, in a bathing suit, and I heard like a. And I would look around, and I knew Grandma was coming with a fly swatter, hitting it against the wall to warn me that she wow. was going to get me with a fly swatter. Wow, yeah. strict Grandma. Yeah. yeah. She didn't. She didn't like my nalgas, is what she would call it. Your what? Nalgas. Oh. It's your butt cheeks hanging uh, out. Hanging out. Well, uh, <laughs> well, I, I have to just disagree with her on that I was one. Not. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that's why my my mom was fairly strict. Was she strict? I remember once my dad and I were watching a fight, because the kitchen was here, and there was a long hall, and then there was the TV room. Mm -hmm. And we're watching a fight, and during the fight, oh, I remember, I took the Lord's name in vain. Yeah, I went, oh, and I hear this, what's that noise? My mother comes in with a pot, bong, just knocked me out. I mean, I didn't, no, way. no, I heard this, I go, what's that, is there another, bong, ow, just knocked me out of the chair. Yeah, so the fly swatter is really not that bad. Yeah, no. <laughs> Look, let's take a break. More with Jessica right after this. Yeah, yeah. Welcome back. Time with Jessica Alba. Into the Blue is her new uh, 
picture. You're talking about your grandmother. Now, now, was she hot on your brother too? Was that a big? Uh... Yeah, my, when uh, when my brother was a kid, uh, especially the baggy pants were in yeah, style, right. and so his friends and he would come over with the big baggy pants and. She would just pull them all the way down. <laughs> yeah. She would just walk them, just be like, you can't wear them half off. You just either off or on. That's wow. how they go. Wow. Grandma yeah. be in jail now. Wow. Well, yeah. I mean, come on. She was really not trying to mess with a 12-year-old kid. Wow. Oh. Now, do you and, are you and your grandma similar in any way? Do you have any similar traits? Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, in, in, in protecting um, our, our men, yeah. Protecting your men? Yeah. What, uh, <laughs> you have a gun? What are you saying? You're, you're the jealous. Oh, well, I know you're very jealous. Is your grandmother jealous too? Is she the jealous? I'm not very jealous to a point where it's unhealthy. I'm healthy jealous. Well, no, I shook your boyfriend's hand and you were like, hey, wait a minute. No. So, you, uh, so you, but you're the jealous type, huh? Well, yeah, you know, I protect him. Really? Yeah. yeah. Now, how about your now? How was your grandmother jealous? Would you would you see her? Was she that way with your grandfather? No, she absolutely was that that yeah. way with uh, my with my grandfather. Any girl that even tried to to look his way, she would go right in front of them like but she wouldn't even try to be cool about it yeah, she yeah. would just go right in front of the women and and stop it right there a lot of girls hitting yeah. on your grandpa <laughs> <laughs> well you know he's, he's like a smart you know yeah, good looking yeah. tall wow. business guy well i saw the movie too and you and paul walker have have a really good set of cameras did you know him before this movie um i met him once before the movie uh, okay yeah okay. Now, but i mean you know i can what? have chemistry with the cup i'm yeah, an actress oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, that's nice to know. Thanks. I feel better now. Great. Wow. Wow. Gee, I, I, I feel so much better now. Oh, now, I read something, and, and this sounds really dopey, but I, 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 you know, I try to do my research on it. Okay. One of the magazines had an article about you and said oh, one brother. of your fantasies, you know what I'm going to say here? I uh, know. Was to make love in the Oval Office. No. That's what it said. Yeah, that that's not true. Well, what, at all. What, what, what should it have said? That it, I think it was the in style article. In style. That's it what was I, in it style. was in style. Yeah. And and it was uh, you know what's hot to you and and they kept saying you know is it you in a bathing suit blah blah and I was like no it's me in a suit and being surrounded by men in bathing suits that's way hotter than, to me oh, okay. than a woman constantly being the, you know the the sexual object like, why can't it be reversed and then sh they were like well yeah. right. <laughs> And then, uh, and then I said, you know, we need a female president, and you know, maybe like a chick in a suit and surrounded by a bunch of little servant men. I don't know. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I was just like bouncing ideas off this lady, and then she put it in print that I wanted to have sex in the Oval Office. So, well, yes. I, I mean, that's how things get interpreted. In yeah, case just was wondering. wrong but, president, yeah. but yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Born a little. Wow. Born too late. The, uh, <laughs> oh, no. so, so tell us about the movie. I enjoyed the movie. You know, again, the, the fun thing about this job is I see movies before I have any idea. All I know is it's into the blue. And then it turned out to be this kind of this thriller with drug runners and treasure. And yeah. it, it, I enjoyed it. It's pretty good. Tell yeah, people what it's about. Yeah, it starts off as this really beautiful movie, and you yeah. just see like a day in the life of these of these island kids. And then it turns into a thriller because they find um, treasure. And in a plane filled with cocaine and dead bodies, right. and it's like, what do you do? And and then all of a sudden, people are after them, and, and their lives are all in danger. So what? it's a fun popcorn movie. Now, what do we have? What's this scene here? This is where uh... this scene. I have a uh, six six two hundred and fifty pound man handcuffed to me, and I'm running away from the bad guys. Okay, and he's dead. He's dead. And you okay? And you're handcuffed. And to I'm the dead handcuffed guy. to him. Okay, let's yeah. see what happens. Here we go. Into the blue.
Be right back with Julian McMahon. Right after this. Any way you want. That's good. Cool. You guys know each other, right? You're old friends. Yes. We're old buddies. Yeah. I attempted to destroy her. <laughs> <laughs> a few times, yeah, off few camera. Times. Yeah. <laughs> On camera, we were great lovers. Yeah. Well, kind I shouldn't of. say that because Cash is here. Cash is here. <laughs> um, so we were really let's great lovers. let's delete that. Yeah. Um, but uh, yes, no, we spent uh, six months basically shooting Fantastic Four together. Right, cool, cool. Yeah. Yeah. And did. then we promoted the movie together yeah. and all that kind of stuff. Now I know you're from Australia, and yes. you're. At this know point, I will confirm that. Yeah, well, I mean, that, that, that seems sort of a, that, that would be like one of the Kennedys. Or That's what exactly well, what yeah. he is. He's Kennedy Jr. It's so crazy. Yeah. I went to Australia with this guy. Yeah. He is a huge star everywhere. And like people like bow down to him. It's weird. Apparently, well, I, have I, a different know, system. I was surprised you didn't get on your knees, sweetheart, <laughs> but uh, let's not take it. You know what? Uh oh, here comes Grandma. Oh, so here sorry. comes Grandma. That was, that that was, is so not who you are. That was so said wrongly, though. <laughs> I meant bow down. Anyway, let's not Same thing, yeah. You know, no, we, we went to... <laughs> Whatever. It's a smaller country. Right. It's a much smaller country. Yes. And so it's a very different thing. Yeah.